Hello everybody, it's another tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to press E to click up materials just in case you want like crafting game. But I'll show you how to craft and make an inventory in another ep episode. This episode is only for picking up materials. So I'm just going to go ahead, go to model, and just create a part. And it's going to be wood. Here's my good part already. I'm gonna go ahead and duplicate this. And then I'm gonna go to workspace, make a tool, and call this wood. And I'm gonna call this wood. And then I'm going to lastly call this candle. Put this into wood. Then I'm going to put this to wood thing next to the storage. Now, we're going to add, go ahead and add an item to this. I'm just going to, whatever this says, pumps exited, punks, MAT point, pumped. Go ahead and add that. And go ahead and add a script to this too. So we're gonna, we're gonna want to get the part. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and get the proximity point. Now, to get started. Actually, first I'm gonna edit this proximity point. Action text. Up, get back to code E, enable object te text. Good. Okay, hold duration one second. That seems good. Now you get the scripting again. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and the box dot trigger that gets for when this is triggered. Again, we're just gonna have to connect that to the function so we can get it started. Now, we only get the tool. Okay, um, equals aim dot replicate storage dot grid. And then we're going to go ahead and go here and press play. Stop it. Sorry. Okay. So local clone equals item clone. Let's clone in the item. Now we want to put the clone dot parent equals player. Wait for child back pack. Also, I'm gonna show you that. And also, when we craft these materials in the episode, I'm gonna show you how to place them. You know. But right now, this is what we're going to do. So after we do that. It's gonna put that in a backpack and we wanna get the part and destroy it. Guess we're done with it. Okay. Oh wow, I would I want some wood to craft in my thing. I I can see some wood. Wood, pick up. Now I have some wood. There you go. Then I'm gonna make some stone. Make a stone part. Okay, 
like this. Then here I'm trying to cut this down. And then D. Now we have stone. I'm gonna add green box and point stone. So now we have two materials stone and we have wood. Man, I need some wood and stone to craft my thing. Wood. Stone. Pick up the stone. There you go. That's how you make a pickup system in Roblox Studio. It's pretty simple. I'll go over it again. Accident point. Script. Put this script in. And then make a tool. Have to handle the exact same model unless you want to change it, which I am fine with that. But there you go. I hope you learned a lot from this episode, and hopefully, next episode I'll be able to drop tomorrow and it'll be um, a I don't know if I'm gonna do a crafting system. I'm probably going to do inventory system first because that would be more helpful. Yeah, I'll do that. Alright, see you in the next episode.